I uh, finished high school in Warsaw, Poland, and I wanted to study in Britain. I chose Birmingham for its excellence in political science and international relations. I was among the founders of the University of Birmingham Polish Society, and I know that it's still alive and kicking, so I'm very proud of that. Um, and also in my final year, I was elected to the Guild Council. It's just an amazing experience. I mean, there's, there's nothing that can teach you more about diplomacy than, than leading a student society committee when you have all sorts of different views and you still need to reach a consensus. I've always been interested in uh, politics and international affairs and it was a natural choice to, um, to study that at university level. So um, it obviously still has impact on what I do because I work in diplomacy at an embassy here in London. In my public diplomacy portfolio I'm responsible for promotional campaigns at the embassy that promote Poland uh, to the British public. I also liaise with the media, both Polish and British and uh, I'm also responsible for the Embassy's um, communication strategy, which some of my friends here at work would equate to tweeting a lot, but I, um, I'd like to think there's a bit more to that. In my typical day, we, we start about nine o'clock. Uh, we go through our mailboxes and uh, the morning press. Um, if there's no crisis, I then um, liaise with our partners to prepare various events that we hold at the Embassy, um, I also file cables to, to the Foreign Ministry in Warsaw. I um, liaise with the media on a daily basis. There's, there's plenty of um, media inquiries every day, uh, both in Polish and in, in English. The most extraordinary experience um, on the job was when I got to welcome uh, Jeremy Paxman to the embassy when he had an interview with um, our Foreign Minister, Radek Sikorski. Um, that was the first time that the Foreign Minister visited since I had started working here. And uh, yeah, before the actual interview for BBC Newsnight, which actually took place in this very room, uh, um, I had my own interview with, with Paxo and I, um, I promise I did not threaten to overrule him. I'm, I'm a huge JR Talking geek, so um, I, I loved all those places in Birmingham that inspired him to write uh, about Middle Earth from Soho Mill that when he, well, he thought of the Shire for the first time um, to exploring the black country, um, otherwise known as the land of Mordor where the shadows lie. Mm -hmm.